Radio EH. Sauce it up. Botou o moleque no bolso. Do you have problems with lag in Call of Duty Mobile? Your problems are over. Use my app to remove the lag and have a low ping. Link in the comments. Hey! Welcome everyone to another new video of tips. If you are not yet subscribed to the channel, I invite you to subscribe, so you don't miss any of the tips to be the best sniper in Call of Duty Mobile. So subscribe. I ask you, please press like to help me and leave a comment. I will answer you. So let's go to the video. In today's video, I will teach you in an easy way how to do quick scopings with maximum precision and technique. These are secret tips that no pro reveals and I will reveal everything today. Now, for this, I recommend that you also watch my previous videos. I made a video about better settings so you can have more speed in your sniper. The link will be in the video description. I also made a video on how to improve accuracy in your sniper. Watch it, it's very easy and practical. Link in the description. The first tip to do quick scoping like a pro, you will put the HUD settings as ads. Put it in the custom option. Go to the sniper rifle and put ads. This option is better for quick scoping. In manual mode the crosshairs open slower. The next tip is to use a point as a custom crosshair to serve as a directional pad. This will make it easier for you to focus to shoot correctly. Many pro players use this, it's very easy to do, cc. You can go to your game's HUD option and drag an icon to the middle of the screen. I chose the configuration gear because it is round. Drag it to the middle of the screen, increase the size to the maximum, center it well between the lines, then decrease the size to the maximum and your custom crosshair is ready. If you don't want to use this point, you can use custom reticles. They are also free and easy to use. You can choose one that has a good center to hit. This will also help you a lot to improve your aim to hit enemies more easily. Use a central one with a dot or cross and practice to get used to it. The next tip is to activate the one tap adds fire option to fire faster than normal. This will make blank scope and quick scopings easier.
Next tip disable the ads button rotation option to have better direction control when shooting. When this option is activated, every time you press the crosshair, you move it. When turned off, it will not move, thus better directing the straight shot. Next tip use the FOV of the pro players to see the enemy better. The most used recommendation is 75 and 65 so you have a closer view and you can move better. By making it even easier to see the enemy, you will be able to do more quickscoping with greater ease at short or long distances. Next tip use realistic scope activated to see the enemy faster when opening the scope. When the option is deactivated, you must wait for the animation to complete. Practice in the training room to improve your aim. With these tips today, you will feel a great difference in your gameplay. Now, as a gift, I will show you the complete loadout that I used in the following gameplays. Copy and use. This is the best gunsmith for the DLQ-33, because it's making a lot of hit marks, and I'm going to switch to the Tundra, so get used to it. Next is the gameplay. Watch until the end and tell me if you liked it. Comments. Until the next video. Bye. O cara sai mais forte. Reloading, cover me. Last one. 
Continua para o Rodrigo. Agora a pessoa não vai apagar.